Well, today marks the groundbreaking for a brand new campus on Chicago's South Side. It is called the Illinois Quantum and Microelectronics Park, and it's predicted to bring thousands of jobs and billions of dollars, but not everybody's on board. NBC5's Lexi Suter is on the story, talking to people on both sides. A dusty lot on the south shore of Chicago will soon transform into a state-of-the-art facility slated to be the country's leading hub for quantum innovation. Quantum has the potential to help solve some of humanity's greatest challenges in national security, artificial intelligence, pharmaceuticals, energy, finance, and beyond. Today, Governor Pritzker was joined by scientists, researchers, and business leaders on the former U.S. Steel site that will become Illinois Quantum and Microelectronics Park. Those at the helm call this project an economic powerhouse that will house several global companies, including Psi Quantum and IBM. I mean, we're not just going to be their neighbors. This is our front yard. You know, this is this is our parks. This is our this is our land. So let's you know, let's do it right. But just before the groundbreaking, several neighbors got together to protest the project. They say the community is not being taken into consideration. I want to preserve the character that's here. Let it represent the community. Let the community get a piece of the pie. It's professionals in this community. Let them be a part of it. They're asking for a CBA or community benefits agreement to ensure they aren't pushed out or put at risk. We want to see, you know, a CBA that's a four-legged stool. We want to see environmental justice, we want to see jobs, we want to see housing, and we want to see education. Because our tax dollars are funding this, so we should get something for our tax money, right? But leaders say this project is a major investment in the south side of the city, especially its people. We are not only remaking a vacant site, we are rebuilding an economic engine for the future and investing in the people on the southeast side. Despite some neighbors' concerns, this project is well on its way. With the groundbreaking today, this marks the largest quantum computing project in all of the United States. Back to you in the studio.